We are going to show you how to replace or repair the keyboard mechanism for the compact keyboards. What you will receive is the rubber spring cup and the key parts. Depending on your purchase, you may or may not have the key cap included in your order. If you do, the clip must be removed from the back of the key before the parts can be installed. To do this, you will flip the key over to expose the parts on the back. You will use a small tool such as a little screwdriver to get underneath the clip and gently pull it away from the key. Now we're going to show you how to attach the clip to the keyboard base. Before you do this, you're going to have to make sure that the clip is oriented in the correct way to be able to go onto the keyboard base. Orienting it means it is rotated correctly and flipped correctly so everything can attach from the metal pieces onto the plastic pieces. The clip shown here is in its correct position. The inner part of the clip looks like a keyhole. The keyhole should be oriented in the position such that this piece here slides underneath this piece of metal here. These two outer feet are going to slide under these two metal pieces. You also need to make sure that the clip is flipped in the correct way. This is upside down. The best way to tell is looking at this inner piece of plastic and looking at this bar here. This bar will be elevated from the base of the clip. This bar needs to slide under this piece of metal here, so if it's elevated upward, it wouldn't make sense how it would clip underneath this piece of metal. Now that piece of plastic is flush with the key that's resting on right now. So what we're going to do now is move the key over onto the keyboard base. You're going to slide that, me that bar we were just talking about underneath this piece of metal. After that's completed, you're going to hold the clip back and you're going to push on the left and the right parts of the clip to get the little feet to clip under these pieces of metal. Now at this point, if the rubber cup is not attached to your keyboard, go ahead and replace it with the one supplied. All you need to do is place it in the middle of the clip and that will be sufficient being held in by the cap. Now you take the key cap, you center it over the clip where it would naturally look on the keyboard and you push down on two corners and then the other two corners. You should hear it snap into place and you should check the key for functionality.